Can you tell me about your favorite subject in school? My favorite subject's probably writing because I love to write and I've been writing for a while. And I write every night before I go to bed and I do it when I'm at home, so. What kinds of things do you write about? Well, I write about all sorts of things. I like to make a lot of stories like nonfiction. I just like search out stuff and then I type it out into a story and add some pictures. How does your teacher help you to write? Um, well, she's a really amazing writer too, so every day she kind of gives us mini lessons, mini lessons on how to do different stuff, like how to do um, paragraphs or how to do, uh, like how to type stuff and make it the font the right size and stuff like that, so. Let's talk about learning plans a little bit. Like, how do you, when you um, walk into your classroom in the morning, or can you talk with me a little bit about like, what that learning plan is, and then how do you just, how do you work with your day? Well, we have a, um, when I come in, some of our learning plans is, we have a whole bunch of like things on the wall. Like, we have this thing that we flip every day. It's like Monday, and then it tells like the time, and like what's happening at that time. So it's really neat because it's like you can always know where you're going and and yeah and we have a whole bunch of like writing things on the wall like essays and we have all our learning targets on one wall and yeah. What do you want to be when you grow up? Well, when I grow up, I want to be a photographer. Yeah. Yeah. How come? I don't know. I just really like taking pictures and I think it's very interesting to see how they turn out and be able to like edit them and. So do you, um, what I heard from you was that you like to be a writer mm -hmm. and that you want to be a photographer someday. Do you think that the two can go hand in hand? Yeah. How can they go, how can photography and writing go hand in hand? Uh, well, they can go hand in hand because you can be like a newspaper writer and, or a newspaper photographer and you could have like your own little part in newspaper and stuff. Or you could like take pictures for a book and like write your own book with your own pictures. That's great. So it sounds like you're a pretty amazing storyteller. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can you tell us about your favorite story that you've ever written? Well, when I was a little bit younger, I was probably around five or six. I wrote a like a seven-page story about goats because I really liked goats, and um, our guidance counselor back then, Mrs. Bison. She loved goats too, and we would often go to her house and see her goat, because my grandmother took care of her kids at a daycare, so we were like really good with her. And um, I wrote all this, I like searched up all this stuff about goats, and I put it into a book, and I took some pictures of her goats and put it in, and then I gave a couple of copies to her, and we kept a couple for myself.